This week on Small Boat Big Ocean TV, we're jigging up sea bass off the coast of New Jersey. So stay tuned, we'll be right back. Small Boat Big Ocean TV is brought to you by Howie T Sport Fishing, Bob K Marine, and Salt Weather, the ultimate marine forecast app. Hey everybody, welcome back to Small Boat Big Ocean TV. This week finds us again going out of Manasquan Inlet, New Jersey. Our original goal was to get out to the 20 fathom line and start trolling for some bluefin. We made about a 30 mile run to a spot where we had gotten on some bluefin early in the season last year. However, when we got there, the, no marks on the fish finder, no signs of life, no birds in the air. So we decided to just deploy a couple wide trackers to see if we couldn't bring anything up uh, that we're not picking up on the fish finder. After about an hour and a half trolling, seeing no marks, no life, no birds, we decided to pull on the wide trackers and then head for the nearest wreck to see if we couldn't jig up some sea bass off the bottom. We were headed in a northerly direction towards an artificial reef site not far from where we were and it didn't take much uh, scanning of the bottom till we finally found a good pocket of fish. Once we figured out the drift, it did not take long until Pat hooked our first fish. Not long after Pat's hookup, Steve's line hit the bottom and he was hooked up as well. The sea bass action is really just starting to heat up, so don't go away. We'll be right back after a short break. Bob K. Marine in Spring City, PA is your one-stop shop for all marine services. From bass boats to bow riders, two and four stroke outboards to large block inboards. Our certified staff can repair just about anything. Bob K. Marine also offers electronics installation, winterization and shrink wrap, plus fiberglass and gel coat repair. Visit Bob K. Marine today for all your marine service needs. Salt Weather is the ultimate marine forecast app. With Salt Weather, you get forecasts from four different models on one screen. 
chlorophyll and sea surface temperatures. Waypoints, distance measuring, plus a whole lot more at a fraction of the cost of other services. everybody welcome back to small boat big ocean tv things are really heating up we located a pocket of fish all by ourselves and have made several drifts over some bottom structure and have boated several sea bass on each path For today's trip, we were using tandem rigs with number four offset circle hooks and six ounce bank sinkers to get us down to the bottom. And just about every haul up, we were getting doubles, uh, just like Steve did right here. As far as bait goes for the day, it's very simple. Cut strips of squid, that's it. I'm not so sure the video does it justice, but the quantity of fish over this little piece of structure was insane. At this point here, all three of us were hooked up. In my never-ending search to try to video things at different angles, uh, and please don't laugh, I decided right, to deploy set. my newly purchased sunglass Everybody video cameras. Have a look. They what? They, they are polarized pretty nicely. Yeah, I can actually see down there pretty good. Well, this is a good one. Either that or I'm doubled. Thank you. 
be close. Ah, you might make it. He hit the gulp. Yep. Close. Well, these guys are pretty good exercise for the wrist. Can you imagine a tuna coming up from 120 pounds? 20? 120 feet. Good double. One's gonna go. I don't know if this guy does or not. Twelve and a half. Yep. Oh, he's in there for the filament, right? While I do admit that the video sunglasses did look a little dorky, uh, I was kind of impressed with the video quality. I did have to edit a little bit of the color balance, but by and large, the quality was pretty good. It was straight HD, 1080p. Uh, so. If you get a chance, why don't you leave me some comments? Let me know what you think of the uh, the video glass footage. <clears throat> well, that made it worthwhile.
After spending about uh, maybe an hour drifting over that one little piece of bottom structure, we were able to uh, successfully boat a three-person limit and I went ahead and double-checked to make sure we had the proper count. Um, and all things considered that we were started looking for bluefin and got skunked, uh, this was a great way to end the day. So uh, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoy. Um, if you did, give us a subscribe, and I would love to hear some comments on what you guys think of the video glasses. Um, so, thanks for tuning in, and we'll catch you next week. This episode of Small Boat Big Ocean TV has been brought to you by Howie T Sport Fishing, Bob K Marine, and salt weather, the ultimate marine forecast app.